Okay, so back at it again. So you can see that the progress of the mod uh, I've been working on, essentially this new map. You can see I've been having a pretty good fun time um, building everything. Uh, kind of go in here real quick, just to let you see it. So this is like all the static props and all kinds of weather weather effects on the terrain and stuff like that. So uh, pretty neat. Anyway. Like the simulation, and what we're going to get into today is <clears throat> scripted events on your maps to make it more interesting. So, like, uh, when you're playing the game, like in the campaign, the scripted events where, like, you can uh, crawl under rubble, um, you can open doors. Uh, they're kind of like little cutscenes almost. But, uh, so what these, uh, how do you do these is essentially these are not static props. These are entities. So if you go in your entity list here and you search for something like, let's say vent. So vent ground here. So as a vent ground is this one right here. So like if you click on it, you can see it says vent ground. This one is the scripted event where you can crawl under stuff. So, here you can see that I basically set up like kind of a, a cool little area that you can't bypass on foot. And you have to crawl underneath of it. And so the way you uh, do this is uh, you just drag and drop it. And you can see it creates like the start point and the end point. You can go either direction by the player. Um, you can see that it has a script task on it so you don't have to do anything. And basically all you got to do is if you want to have an area with a uh, scripted crawling task. You just drop that and put your props around it like I did. So I'll show you how this works. We'll just go in game. Let me go up to it so you can see I can't get through this. And you can start crawling through. I like these, like on the modern maps, it gives it a little bit more immersion instead of just like, you know, walking everywhere. So they're pretty fun. And then you can go back through. Yep. And so that's just one. So we'll go back. And there's quite a bit of these um, already pre-built that you can drag and drop. So another one over here is I got another wall here. Um, and I wanted like a scripted event with a door. So like if I click on this one, you can see that is a it's a prefab, uh, so it's a door right here. So you see it has an effect on it for a padlock. Um, so this one and the entity list, you can just search for door and you can drag it here. So you can see there it is, or I can put a different one. So there's all kinds of different ones. This one. Got one, uh, one of these has like a turn on it. Yeah, like that one. So you can put these in place, make entering areas a little bit more cool. So like here you can go in, do that. Or like this one. Just open it and it just gives it a little bit more immersion. So they're pretty sweet. So that's how you add a uh, kind of like cool little scripted events from the entity list. Hope that helps.